if you want to do a hundred dollar a day, it will spit out more fish. Just convince me a little bit more. You have the power. Tell me how much you offer me now. That's the machine. The expand and the SMS is the fuel. You buy the machine and then they keep putting. It's, it's a good idea. Let's do it and uh, send me the paperwork. When someone says cool, let's move forward. Just send me the paperwork. I'll do everything after the call. Red flag. Do not do that. Kang here, your very own Go Hello Ninja. In today's video, I'm gonna be shooting something completely different. I'm going to play my old recording and I'm gonna give myself a very rough feedback the good the bad and the ugly of my own call recording this is what I know now my belief my perspective my skill in terms of sales could be very different it can give us some new insight there let's just start one to take action on today I can drop the price down to 5800 just 5800 plus ad spend and SMS so back then I was using Google slide I was pitching using slide which I'm no longer using right now and doing like one price in one page and I do a price drop on the other page that is a very bad style of selling in my opinion especially in 2023 because first of all you shouldn't be giving discount to your service and you only give discount if they really want to do it and then they have some financial constraint and they really asking for you to help them out right that's probably the only scenario that I would go for in this case we have like one page saying it's 9k now it's saying it's 58 total saving of 4,000 bucks is this um there's a gst apply or it's just inclusive include everything man so the only thing that is not included is the ad spend and sms you gotta pay for ad spend and sms so give that amount how much is the sms it's a few cents per tax so um look ad spend and sms give it around 1k a month extra that's, that's the fuel, so that's the machine. The ad spend and the SMS is the fuel, okay? You buy the machine and then they keep putting, and that's not limited. I give you a recommendation. If you wanna spend two X or three X, that it's gonna splitting out more fish based on. Okay. okay, so. So the good thing about that is I always like to use analogy in terms of storytelling, especially when you're selling tech stuff like go high level or Facebook ad, you always, you know, make an analogy saying this is the fish and this is the fuel. You put more fuel, you get more fish. Making it so simple that an everyday person can understand it. That's the what I think I did well on that call. It's like 5,800 for three months. Mm -hmm. uh, what's, what happened after three months? Renegotiate term by then. You know, you're going to say, hey, you, you want to, I, I want done for you. Just keep managing that for me. And then, oh, now I just want to do something to buy myself, all that stuff. So we're going to recreate it. And by 90 day, you should get a very good feel on how everything comes together. Okay. Well, it's, it should, you should be very honest. It's a good idea. It's a good idea. And uh, I just want to see that because, you know, three months, it's, I want to see the one year plan. If you can tell me after three months or whatever, I guess I hate it. Once we said, I uh, forgot about it and we just keep running. And uh, I'll talk, I'll look at the price initially, which was between that. But uh, once we set up, I would never question about how much cost or whatever. I'll just mm. set up the red debit or this kind of crap, you know? It's, it's fun. Quick tip here, you want to listen to the cue. If someone say, use the word and the language that he just did, that means like they got a lot of money in their business to invest, right? So if someone said, once I get set up, I don't even care how much I'm going to spend as long as it get result. So those are like the good client that you should like pursue and make sure that you do everything you can to keep them, right? Because they got money, they have a very well run business. They really just need good service and good help. After three months, what's going to happen? Yeah, we, we're going to renew. Yeah. Yeah. So how much for this fund half for five thousand eight hundred, there's a lot of involved in lots of setup, this kind of stuff already. But after if we renew, it won't you know what I mean? How much will be? Well it, it it's gonna be the same price because we it, it's you I, I don't think you understand because with the ad, it's like T V ad, right? So if you have like the same campaign but like with the same girl having the same story it, it get it gets sick people get sick of it okay it's gonna keep and rotating and all that stuff and that's in in the next month we're gonna be a bit you know campaign rotation and retargeting all that stuff but really we can discuss that you know at the end of the 90 day term where we actually I'll, I'll find out what is actually best for you okay mm -hmm. so you say your best price for now today is five eight plus whatever ongoing cost yeah but we we set up a limit is that what you mean you what, sorry? So on the S spend, we set up, say, it's like 30 days, 30 dollars a day. Yeah, that's the recommend. So like, if you want to do a hundred dollars a day, it will spit out more fish, like, like I mentioned. 
But we'll be settled. But if the if we didn't stray that much, it will roll over to next day. Is that what I mean? Yeah, yeah. So um, that one is is you spend directly to Facebook. We don't we don't touch that money. It's gonna be directly paid to Facebook. Okay, okay, okay. Right. Is the five eight the, the best price? It's typical Asian talk. <laughs> Asian talk. <laughs> <laughs> Mate, look, um, this, I, I, let me show you something. This is the end of the slide. This is the end of the slide. Okay. End of we the want, slide, we right? We want to do it, we want to do it, and uh, it's just, just, you know, if we want to set up, we can set up, you know, not, not now because Christmas, you know, our, yeah. our time with money is wasted. I'm back to work second week of January. Yeah. And uh, next week will be my last, last week. Yeah. Um, it's, it works, I can see it works. Just, you know, you convince me a little bit more, you have the power, tell me how much, how much you, you offer me now. When, 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 when do you want to start? One second. My holiday starts next Saturday, so there's no point to set up everything now. We, I have to work on 4th. 4th of January. Yeah, 4th of January. So basically we can start at, um, I'll, I'll be very tired after that. Uh, we can start at, um, you know, the, um, on 11th, you know, yeah. of January. Yeah. Which is after New Year, you know, otherwise, you know, So, um, notice the queue there. He was paying, he was directing both of our focus into the discount, which is the pricing. But then I direct him to when is he want to start. So I sort of not answering the question, but I sort of divert the focus, the discount. So let's see what I did there. And then after New Year, will be more ideal. Yeah. So look, mate. Um, honestly, our system is proven to work, and we, we don't really give discount. Like aside from that, we we actually gonna put it up for the next next couple of guys when we get more agents. We're gonna put up to six eight or seven eight. Really. Um, let me ask you this: How much sell do you have to make to actually break even? Because like one sell for you is how much, 12k. How much sales are to make to break, break even? What's that mean? To break even from this investment. Half. <laughs> All right, zero point five sell, and that's the ninety day. Like if you can't make one sale within 90 days. I think that is a very good question. When someone asks you about the price or they ask you about anything at all is that they try to direct your focus, both of our focus into that aspect. So to the price, to the discount. I was asked when he's gonna start. Now I asking how much money is he gonna make back, right? And when the ROI, the return on investment seems so huge, right? Suddenly this 5,800 doesn't seem that big anymore. Right, so that was, I think, it was a really well thing that I'd done in the past. Um, I don't know what to say. Look, yeah, um, yeah, 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 yeah. so well, what, it's, what's it's, the main concern it's, here? So, so, just came on mind. So there's five, eight hundred and uh, inclusive GST. Yeah. And plus whatever I, I, I need to pay for it. Who I pay SMS to? Three deal. But we, we walked you through all of that. I don't want to confuse yeah, you right yeah, now. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. We'll, okay. just, just, so your cost, your cost is five, eight hundred full stop. Investment not cost, but yep, go on. Wow, 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 look at the cost. Come on, what? I'm salesman. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's business cash flow. Yeah, alright, yeah. Cash flow perspective, I get it. So, yeah. yeah. Alright, guys, make sure that, like, it's, it's six minutes so far. Make sure that, you know, when you discuss price and discount, just, just like laugh a bit, just like jokes a bit. Just make sure that you loosen up the tension. Like, the prospect will like appreciate that like like unknowingly like in this un you know subconscious level they will really appreciate that it just like you know you don't want the conversation to get too tense you will keep laughing back and forth this rapport there what um being i think is the good side of it as well well i'm start doing business when i'll start eating that <laughs> all right I'm that's just, younger than me man uh younger than me uh yeah, re respect that yeah and uh, I you know you're Asian, I like you guys, and uh, you know it's it's a good idea. Uh, I will do it. I will do it. Yeah. And uh, keep the trick. Let's do it. And uh, yeah. Yeah. Best price we can offer me. Send me the paperwork, and uh, let's try 90 days. You know. So what we do is we can process the payment now, and we get all everything set up, and then we're gonna launch on the fourth, uh, maybe like the next week yeah. after the January, yeah. 11th of January, right? Uh -huh. All right, so we can um, actually process everything right now on this call. Processing, how, how, how process? You do this from your background, to be honest, and uh, I can't keep this, you know, talking, you know, I don't want to set up when... You can do it on your background. What, what do you mean? What, what I can do, I can send you...
what I normally do on in the past is that when someone said, okay, it's cool, let's move forward. Just send me the paperwork. I'll do everything after the call. Red flag, red flag. Do not do that. Do not follow them. What I said, oh, sweet, it's easy. The process here is really simple. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do everything right now on a Zoom call. It's just a quick form you have to fill with your credit card info. Get it done on the call because when they get off that call, something could happen. Like, you know, something could happen and it happens all the time. You can lose a deal if you let them go. I would say I would try as much as possible without being too pushy to get everything done, especially when there's a high ticket sales guy. The invoice right now and then you can yeah. just process it. Or we can take the credit card right now and then I process it on my end. Which one you um, want to do? Just pay online or, or pay yeah. Or whatever. Yeah, it's... it's it's an invoice, I send it to you, and then you pay it through an a online invoice with a card, you put in your card in there and just pay, right? Mm -hmm. Or you, mm -hmm. you can okay. uh, give me the credit card and I'll pass that on right now and process on my end. Okay, I'll send me the invoice, but uh, before I send it So the call recording just stopped there. I'll just show you a screenshot here of the deal being closed actually for 1K more at 6,800 instead of 5,800 because of an upsell that we did. Okay, the rest of the video is just, just taking card information, signing contract with sensitive information. So there's no point of showing you guys there. But the deal is close, right? You can see by the tonality, but here's the proof anyway. So yeah, look, if you like more video like this, let me know in the comment. I would love to run through my thought process. I love this game. Like I love sales. I love doing it. I love teaching it. I love talking about it. So this is my free gift to you. This is going to be our exact script that we actually use to actually enroll our client right now. And it's actually more refined than the one that you see in the call because we've been refining it since then. Right? And this document, I'm going to make sure to leave it in the comment below underneath this video. And it's going to be outlined anything from objection handling, pitch offer, the process, the script, the framework and even what to do before the sales call right? reminder here if you are an agency owner we're offering a free script audit for you to see how we can help change or actually work together in terms of refine to sell process and if you're a remote sales advisor who looking to partner up or work with a top performing agency who actually get results for real estate agent in australia there's a link to also apply to actually work with us Hey guys, if you enjoy watching the video, make sure that you're also checking out this content right there.